I don't know what their uh, preferred gender pronouns are. Someone in the chat might know. Any pronouns? Okay, word. Chris Tyson came out of the gate swinging with this tweet after uh, Blix, La Blix, tweeted, bro, what the f*** happened? Okay. Uh, Chris responds, says, HRT, and it's only been two months. And, of course, after anyone says that they're on HRT or uh, they are, uh, you know, trans, all hell breaks loose. Everyone has a take. Okay. People were just like straight up bullying uh, Chris, like endlessly on the timeline because, you know, easy, easy marker, easy mark. You know, oh, this person's trans. Immediately, let's start making fun of them, yelling at them. I don't know why people are such freaks, but it's just the way it is. Um, so then uh, Chris Tyson tweeted out, informed consent and HRT saved my and many others' lives. The hurdles... Gender non-confirming people have to jump through to get life-saving, gender-affirming healthcare in a first country, first world country is wild to me. Just let people make informed decisions about their own bodies. They're doing it with CRT, brother. They're doing it with HRT. Mr. Beast actually came out, uh, as, as, has been supportive, and is still supportive. That's good. And it's important. I mean, this is the largest YouTuber on the planet. Remember, that's like... That is significant. Responded to the speculation about his gender identity, revealing being on HRT for two months. Chris then shared his stance and experiment with HRT, speaking to challenges of pursuing gender-affirming health care. Mr. Beast responded in support to his statement. For context, HRT is hormone replacement therapy. Gender-affirming HRT consists of estrogen to, or testosterone helping people transition and align their bodies with their gender identity. One of the most expected things of all time happened. Someone came out of the gate swinging. Let me see if I can find it. I'm about to flashbang you, but also break your mind. That's right. Kill a Keemstar of the drama alert variety came out and said, Chris from Mr. Beast becoming trans has gotten more hate than I've seen online in a very long time. Millions and millions of views just hating. People online have to stop this harassment, especially the comments about his wife and child. You are not, Chris. This decision is a... You are not, Chris. This decision is a decision only Chris can make. Do better. Online people's lives are subject to commentary. I'd imagine someone who hosts a show discussing drama in online people's lives would understand this. He put it out for the world, and the world is allowed to respond. If it was for him, he should have just kept it private. Now, this is an incredibly rare Keemstar W. And it's very odd, but good on him. I will admit, when Keem does something, very good. Um, also freaks like this. I don't know what to say about, I just like, I it's just like, oh, why don't they keep it a secret? It's like, it's not that you fucking idiot. The problem is you're a hateful piece. Of shit. Okay. Literally exists in communities that are also equally as hateful and monstrous. And it's completely distorted your worldview into thinking that other people are just as awful as you are. Okay? But yeah, I'm happy for Chris. Y'all read some of the comments? No, I don't want to do that. Let's not keem Keemstar too much credit here. Ethan Klein's being called out for labeling Chris a king after Chris announced that they're on hormone replacement therapy. Many feel Ethan should have said queen instead. <laughs> Okay, to be fair, to be fair, that was <laughs> unintentionally funny. 
And also, I think it's uh, any pronouns that works, right? <sighs> Blank and Ethan from the left, Omega Lol. Yeah. That's why I go for Themperer. Okay. Vampir is what you can use if someone is non-binary. I know I IKR, what does that mean? I know right. Keemstar also cobbles are just annoying because they live off his hate. Also, Keemstar is extra annoying because he's literally transphobic. The head of dr the drama alert news team is trans. She was hired seven years ago before her transition. She's literally second in charge of my entire news organization. What the f Bro, that's so weird. Like that, it's just like, it doesn't track, you know? And it's like breaking my brain a little bit to see Keemstar on the right side of like any political issue whatsoever.